Hey guys, Saturday, Fit Fluential Proof Part 2. Um, you saw the earlier video. I did that um, Zuzana workout of the day. I'm drinking my green tea. My green tea. I was getting my southern accent on. You think I've been hanging around with Amy Bradley Hall, for God's sake. Having pimento cheese and sweet tea. I used to live in the South, y'all, just for a year. And I actually found myself seeing things like sweet tea. And are y'all fixing to go down the beach? I'll meet you down there. I'll meet you at the Jubilee. I'm not making fun of Southern people. I adore you. A lot of my friends are Southern. In fact, I'm planning to move back to the South. I just think it's adorable. Just like Boston accents are adorable. New York accents are adorable. I don't have an accent. Do I have an accent? Kind of like vanilla Midwest girl. Holy heck. So here's what I did. As you know, I did the uh, Susanna workout of the day. Uh, and as you can see, I don't have my polar heart rate monitor on right now because that little thing is pissing me off. I started to say my, my heart rate was like 200 and then 88 and then I'm just over it. Oh my God. I did, anyway, I put Kathy's muscle I almost said muscle mix. It's muscle max. And I did the upper body, uh, the upper body mix. Let me just tell you, just me holding my hands up like this, like I usually do, you know, I'm always like, this is hurting. That, that means you know it's a good workout. Whew. We did shoulders, we did back, we did biceps. Mr. Flo, of course I'll kick your ass. And uh, triceps and chest. And here's the thing, you guys. I've talked about this in the past. Usually, I don't know about you, the things that you avoid the most when you work out, do you find that this is true? The things that you avoid doing the most are probably the areas that you need it the most. Um, and I was sitting, I was actually standing, over near my television here, because I'm in my kitchen slash living room, whatever. When you live in a condo, you don't really have separate rooms. Um, standing over there by my TV, and I was doing the triceps, um, and she was doing a superset between not overhead press, tricep, screw up, you know, when you hold the thing over and you, I can't talk today right now, I'm just, whatever, and then you do dips, and I'm sitting there going, you know, I should put a little note up on my TV that these are the things that I should do before I allow myself to watch Fringe or CSI or anything like that, all the things that I tend to avoid. I don't care for working my triceps, I don't like working my chest, um, and then I tend to, as much as I love core moves, the thing that I've done the least of, does that make sense, least? Oh God, my arms are hurting. The thing I've done the least has been core, other than plank, and you know why? It's because I hate this, once I went into this perimenopause phase of life, I've always had a flat, flat, flat stomach, and once I got this little pudge, I didn't like doing, you know, crunches and stuff where I could look down and go, damn it! So, how stupid is that? Because avoiding what you don't want to see isn't gonna make it go away. So, here's the thing. I'm putting a note up, I'll even take a picture, on my television, and there's no way I'm allowed to sit down and watch my television show unless I've done some push-ups for my chest, some tricep dips, and some core moves that are not plank. Because plank I do all day. I love plank. Plank and wall sits. <sighs> Oh my God, my shoulders and my biceps and my back. Oh, I love this song. Um, so, just a little reminder, whatever it is that you hate doing is probably what you need to focus on doing the most. Certainly know that that's my case. What I need to do right now is go stretch. So, you guys have a good day. Um, still working on my leftover protein shake. And now I'm gonna go stretch and obviously get a shower. I'm kind of sweating my ass off. Not as much, but it's a little cold out today. So, you guys have a good rest of the day. No excuses. I am sick, supposedly, a little sore throat. And as you can tell, I'm not going, oh, it was awful. In fact, yeah, it still hurts when I swallow. Everybody pray for me that I get better by tomorrow. I'm taking another uh, zinc in an hour and a half. Talk to you later.